Hey everyone, welcome back to part two. Sorry it's taken so long. Been having a few technical difficulties. Um, so I'm gonna finish these off for you today. And we are gonna start with some of this nice transfer foil. And I already pre-did the hearts. I don't know what I was doing, I was on a, a call of some sorts and I was just faffing and realized I forgot to, that I was recording the video and just pre-did it. So I've taken some of the Lacarte foil glue gel and I'm going to pop it into the hearts just around in places, well basically in the hearts. I'm going to take some of these foils, these roses, just to sort of add colour and I don't know what I was going with this. This set was kind of like, I had a vision, vision didn't quite work, but yeah, I'm getting there, I've got there, I've completed it. And basically, all I did was I downloaded a um, editing video on my uh, phone. It's called Power Director. It's quite a good actual app, actually. I quite enjoyed using it. And I basically, I've just done everything in there the best that I can with all the uh, the bits available. And I don't know really what else to say. Just excuse the noise in the background, it's my kitty cat. And I'm having to uh, hide in my kitchen whilst I do this voiceover as uh, stepkids are over. And I'm just gonna continue doing that all the way down till I filled in all the hearts and use the transfer foil. And once I have done that, I think I put a base coat over it. But yeah, so do hopefully watch out because I have a video in mind coming up hopefully soon. We'll just see how it goes, probably in a couple of weeks. I'm going to have an attempt at something and see how it goes. I don't know what to say. Yeah, so here we go. Base coat going on just to protect the foil more than anything the transfer foil otherwise it'll just get ruined whilst i'm wiping things off on my next stage of this nail so i'm going to take my nail art paint it's the black one it's the one i got from timu i use it all the time and i mean all the time and i am just going to pop it around the hearts going all the way down i'll show you me doing i think this one and then i'll come back and show you a little bit more that I did to it. I believe I connected them all together. I do apologize if this video isn't as, I don't know, smooth as I would normally do it. I just, I could not get it to load onto my, um, my editing program on my PC, which is DaVinci Resolve. I love using that editing program. Just, it's a format I think I did with my video. I recorded it in and it just wouldn't work it would not work and I apologize about the noise in the background the uh, step boy is on the PlayStation or Xbox yeah on the Xbox like I said I've had to come into the kitchen just to get a little bit of peace and quiet well a bit of peace and quiet just to, to, to voice over whilst I'm going and then I don't know what Sunday or Sunday morning at the moment so I'm not sure what's next on my list of to-dos today but I'm sure I'll find some it freaking dog next door started now God, no peace no peace hopefully the audio for this voiceover is okay I've never done it on this app before so it's all a learning curve we will see how it goes you never know you may use the app a little bit more let's see how it goes I did find it a little bit faster editing wise but we'll see we'll see see how it goes uh, yep so on this you can see me just connecting it all together I, I literally I have no idea what I was planning on this I really did not so on this now I am going to put as you can see to the left of me there are some cut out foils transfer foils and 
I'm going to put, it's not cluster because it's only two roses, but it's just uh, at the top like that, well at the bottom, and then I'm going to put some at the top. I did have to redo this once, but I didn't want to leave it in for you. It was, it, I don't know, I just couldn't. New editing program and all that, so I didn't want to try and faff. So I did it once, I wiped it off, and now I'm redoing it again just to see how it uh, turns out. Um, I think this, it, they, they did turn out all right. I did like them, they were nice. They just wasn't what I was going for with this one. But it's how you learn, isn't it? It's a learning curve. And I've taken another bit and I'm just gonna place it on the bottom just to fill in that bottom space, I suppose. There was a little bit of a gap. So I've just taken that one and I'm just doing that with that one. But yeah, oh. and then I think base coat again, as I normally do. I do it just to protect the foil, so if I make a mistake or anything, I don't wipe it off and I won't have to redo it all over again. But I don't believe I do it. Any, the only thing I put on there is a little charm. Well, I say a little charm, it's not tiny. But it's just enough to fit in there. It's like he's in, sitting on a bed of roses, I suppose. Possibly. We'll go with that, shall we? <laughs> Excuse me. Sitting on a bed of roses. And then, yeah, I'll just put some of this. It's McCart Rhinestone Glue Gel. And I will pop the teddy bear on there. I will try and remember to list everything down below if I can. It's just, like I say, it's a new editing software and I don't normally upload via my phone. I normally do it via my PC. So I've never done it by a phone, so I will try my very best. If I can't, most of what I've used here you can either find on Amazon or I think the charms came from, I want to say Shein? It could have been Timu, one of the two. So I'm going to take these water decals. Them I think came from Amazon. I think and I'm just going to place them on the two nails sort of in the middle either side of the teddy bear and just give it some so I just didn't know what I was doing now and it taken me a little while to finish this set off I started it and then things just got like a bit crazy a bit busy just not had time so I decided sort of like last night I get the set finished and get the video up because it'd been a cut it'd been I think it's been nearly two weeks since I posted the last video. So I thought I'd best get it done out of the way. And then what I'm gonna do is I have a week off soon. So in that week I am going to an attempt a nail trend that's I suppose it's been going around for ages, but I've, I'm only just jumping on the wagon, I suppose you could say. So, I will not say what. You'll just have to wait and see once I've done it. I have been doing a little practicing with it, just to get things, see how to do. But I will. And I'm going to try and make them like a press-on set too, so we'll see how that goes. So, back to the video. I am putting on some base coat. So as you see, I've put the water decals on the top and the bottom. And I'm just putting some base coat on to protect them. Yes, my little one. It's my little kitty cat. A, he's a mama's boy. So yeah, this is what I've got so far. I wasn't, I didn't know if to leave them shiny or go matte. So I went with matte, matte top coat. I wasn't sure about the 3D teddy bear, but you'll see what happens a bit in a few minutes at what I do. But I'm just literally going to matte top coat everything apart from the teddy bears. I will not matte top coat them just yet. Well, the one on the right I will leave as it is. Just put matte top coat around it. And then, yeah, I'll let you know what happens. So this one. I took off the stand because I didn't want to attempt to try and do it and map the 
October. Yes, my baby. What's the matter? Little rat. I'd say he's a quite a mama's boy, this kitty cat. Aren't you? Aren't you? Yes. And then I didn't like this teddy bear shiny. So I matted him, but I did not mat the little heart in the middle of him. Well, actually, no, what I did at first, sorry. Just grab that at first. I basically did all the darker pink I matte top coated. That's what I did first. Yes. Honestly, it took, I couldn't make my mind up with it at all. But yeah, I matte top coated those bits. And then as the video progresses, you'll notice that I matte top coat everything but the little pink heart in the middle. Where are we going? <laughs> Sorry, kitty cat's falling off the chair. And then, yeah, come on, video. I'll leave you to sit and watch this bit just for a moment. What blue face? No, you're not getting up. Right, so back to the video. This is where you'll see me matte top coating the whole teddy bear because I just didn't like that little bit matte top coated. And I will just fiddle here, pop it in the lamp, and then I fiddle a bit more and eventually I'll get it to how I want it. Eventually. But yeah. Uh, yeah, so then it comes out. There's a few bits here and there that had it, but I'm going to take this it's a top coat, a glitter top coat. It's Fornax, I think it was called. I'm just gonna take a little bit of that and I believe I pop it on to the heart. I just thought I'd give it a little bit more sparkle. And then, I can't remember if I put it, I've only uploaded, I only did this about an hour or so ago. Edited it and now I can't remember if I showed you what I did after. Let's see, what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Oh no. I am just basically on this now. I just, it was just too matte. So what I'm doing is I've taken that same top coat, glittery top coaty thing. Excuse my head in the corner there. I put it around on the black lines just to give it a bit of summit summit. I don't know. I literally the set I don't know. And then I don't show, I don't think I've done it yet, but what I'm doing is once again taking that top coat, a glittery top coat, and I am going to pop it on the hearts. Just to give a bit more shiny sparkle on them. And then I can't remember if I show it in the video, but I do end up putting some of that top coat on the dark parts of teddy bear on its feet eyes ears oh no i think i'll leave his eyes but i do it on the ears nose and that so this is the final look here is a nice little close-up for you i do hope you liked the little video please do remember to like share and subscribe don't forget to click that notification bell as well so you don't miss future uploads which hopefully will get regular and until the next time, I will see you in the next video. Have a lovely week. And I will see you again soon.